Aer Lingus has confirmed that one return flight between Dublin and Brussels has been cancelled this evening. Yesterday... In London, the bill to disapply parts of the Northern Ireland Protocol is being given its second reading in the House of Commons this evening. Now, still to come on the programme, more on Paul Reid's decision to step down as CEO of the HSC after only three years in the job. We'll be discussing his legacy and what awaits his successor. Well, let's have a word now with our London correspondent, John Kilrain. John, listen. Well, returning now to that announcement by Paul Reid that he's to step down as CEO of the HSC at the end of the year. We're joined now by Brian Turner, an economist and lecturer at Cork University Business School at UCC who specialises in health. A Paul Reid, all key players during the COVID pandemic and now all leaving the pitch. Firefighting, the health service still has the problems it had before COVID. And COVID, do you think, will be the biggest challenge for whoever succeeds? You know, that this was this radical 10-year plan. We're nearly halfway through that 10 years already. South African authorities investigating the deaths of 21 teenagers at a tavern say they were probably killed by something they ate, drank or smoked. Paul Reid is to step down from his role as chief executive of the HSE at the end of this year. In a statement, the HSE said that Mr Reid made the decision due to a desire to spend more time with his family. The Taoiseach has paid tribute to him in particular for what he said was his extraordinary leadership 